Na wale wangali jana niliwaambia sita toka hapa. Sisi walikuwa nimesimama hapa. Niliwaambia nini? Ninajua wale wamefanya kitambo nitoka hapa nitatoka na wao. Hata leo wale wamebaki. You are better off kusema. We shall be with you all through. We shall be with you all through so that we are able to complete the uh, the syllabuses, do the exams and you go home. You have one week and I have to go. Si tutamaliza tu. Boys tutamaliza hiyo, ndio? Yes. Yes. But if there's anybody around you who, are, who is here and is causing you that problem, don't keep him. Hata hivyo viongozi hao waliahidi kuwasaidia wanafunzi walioadhirika ili waendeleze masomo yao. The area member of government, the area member of parliament is going to provide for us 140 double decker beds to be used by you. The school is also going to provide for you uniform those who are particular Six students have been arrested. They are in the cells. Because police investigation indicates that they were the main culprit. We are going to force the parents of those students to contribute towards the construction of that dormitory. Yeah. We are not going just to leave it every time you leave it on leaders. So parents will meet part of the cost of construction of that building. We are not going to leave it to CDF alone. We are not going to leave it to the county government. Kulingana na wazazi. Kisa hiki ni cha tatu kutokea katika shule hiyo. Hidi mara tatu kuchomu. Na kuna inside job watu wa village hapa. Wana collide na watoto hapa kuchoma shule. Jana na sike mpia liku hapa, haka na watoto wa shule. Usiku. Gari yake ya mbele kiwe mevunjwa ya nyome mevunjwa. Gari mbreko police station. Ntai kutuambia kianso mzuri ya watoto kufukuza ta mpia hapa. And we just want to say, this school, the performance is improving. Let us keep the tempo. Katika mkasa mungine tofauti, shule ya St. Peter's mumia silio katika eneo bunge la mumia silikadiria asara kubwa, baada ya boni laki kuteketea kwa njia tatanishi. Shedra Kareria, Look Up TV.